Carly and I wanted to come on here and do a little review of the Delta Children's Double Bassinet. Since my twins have now outgrown it, which is crazy, they're three and a half months and they are combined over the 30 limit weight limit for it. So we are getting rid of it, passing it along to another happy twin family. So I wanted to do a quick review since it's pretty new before I actually did that. So let me flip you around here. So here it is, the Delta Children's Double Bassinet. It has a mesh liner that separates the two stalls and the changing pad does come out and it's not um, exactly oval. It's like square towards the middle and then it rounds on the edges. And so it does have its own special sheet that goes over it. I'm sure a regular sheet would fit fine too, but it just might be, might not be as tight. Um, and then I would actually put down a waterproof liner and then I would put like a receiving blanket over the top because my kids spit up a lot. And so that's what I did. It has four pockets, two on the front, two on the back. They're pretty big pockets. I only actually used the front two because I had it leaning up against the wall, or not leaning, but pushed up against the wall. And I had burp cloths in there, their diapers, wipes, extra receiving blankets, all sorts of things, and it worked out great. It does extend up so you can make it taller and you can make the feet wider and narrower and it's supposed to be able to go over your bed but if you have a bed like mine which is um, a bed frame that goes pretty much to the floor it's not going to work for it and then it also does have wheels on it but honestly these wheels like they do not work <laughs> For me, um, it is carpet, so it's not going to be, it's not going to work as great for carpet, but I don't even know if they would work that great on hardwood, to be honest, because there's only wheels on the front two legs. They're not on the back, so I think the idea is to be able to scoot it in and out from your bed, but I honestly don't know how great that that would even work, but I didn't, I didn't have it over the, our bed because our bed is an adjustable bed, and so it wouldn't have made sense. Also... I had a c-section and a lot of twin moms are going to have a c-section and so I needed to like brace myself and get up and not crawl to the end of the bed if that was over the bed if that makes sense so like I had it here and I had it pushed up against the wall so I had a little walkway where I could sit up put my feet over and get the baby out if you have the bassinet over your bed you would have to literally crawl around the bassinet and get off to go to the bathroom and with a c-section there was no way I was going to be able to do that and so just food for thought um this was just a really affordable alternative to the halo bassinet I had wanted the halo bassinet so bad but I could not stomach paying five hundred dollars for a bassinet that they were going to sleep in for three months, which is all they slept in, it was only three months. And this worked out just fine. Um, it does not have any bells and whistles on it. It's just your standard bassinet. It doesn't have, you know, vibrations or sounds or projector lights that go on the ceiling. I had looked at all that type of stuff that I really wanted and I honestly didn't need it. They're so tiny and sleepy at that age that they really don't care about any of that. Now that they're three months old, they care about that stuff way more, um, but they don't even use the bassinet now. So I don't think it's really needed. So this was a great little investment for us and it worked out perfect for our family. I love the sleek design. I love the colors, the gray and white. Um, it worked out great. We have boy and girl twins, so it matched you know, the blue stuff and the pink stuff and it matched our room. As you can see, our room is like in grays and everything also. So I, I really loved it. Like I said, I had just wanted to do a quick review of the bassinet because there wasn't any out there when I was looking for it because it's pretty new. It came out in spring. It's now just fall. So if you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask. And if you like this video and if it helped you out, please go ahead and like it. And then if you want to follow along with my family and our sweet little twins, go ahead and subscribe. Thanks.